Hello and welcome to FDTV. In this series of episodes, we are looking at Seat's family of SUVs, from the very first Ateca, followed by Arona, through to their latest edition, Terraco, all designed in Barcelona. In this particular episode, we'll be analyzing the design, roominess, handling and style of all three SUVs. And we'll be speaking with Giuseppe Tomasa, Fleet Sales and Remarketing Director, Joaquin Garcia, Manager for Exterior Design, and Lucas Casanovas, Head of Product Marketing Worldwide at SEAT. We ask our interviewees to talk us through some of the most important aspects of the evolution in style for the SEAT for Business range. If we think of the most important elements in the evolution of the style of the Arona, the Ateca and the Taraco, um, definitely uh, we have to understand that they all uh, make a family, a family of SUVs for SEAT. Therefore, we created a design DNA specifically for SUVs that include, for example, the treatment of the front end, which is robust, is chunky, is also young, especially in the case of the Arona. And then it's getting a little bit more mature, if you like, uh, uh, on the Ateca, and again more and more premium in this case, in the case of the Taraco. Uh, also, we um, uh, underline the side graphic of the window, that is also very characteristic. On the Arona, it has even, the, as you know, the separation of the roof, the color separation, which is a, a, an added uh, a cool feature uh, in a car like the Arona. And then in the Ateca and the Taraco, you can see how this window graphic is very similar, and this creates once again this family look. If you permit, I would like to start from uh, the non-SUV models because Seat really made a big change with the Leon, with the current Leon that uh, was completely different from the previous one. So we were already putting Seat on a different level. Then we continue with the other models. Ateca was one of the most beautiful SUV in our segment. Ibiza, one of the best, again, uh, small cars in the A segment. Aron again designed with a particular style. Now, if you see the roof in the corners or the or the windscreen and also the lateral windows, arriving to Tarrago, our flagship that is even giving a new identity and new style of Seat models. Design is always important to car manufacturers, so we ask Seat how they ensure to leave a mark on this new range. To work on the design is very easy for us because uh, we live in Barcelona. It's a city with 300 days of sun per year, so we are really much influenced by this environment. We are very positive, we are very warm, we are very modern, and this is reflected in our cars. If you see our cars are completely different from the competitors, the design is really our asset, and even when we have clinics with the customer, they recognize the set models much different from the others. And also looking at the fleet markets that is very conservative, is very rational, uh, the design is always playing a, a good role. So they can have a very good car, but also with a very appealing design. And this is making our brand more and more attractive. The design is extremely important uh, for a car manufacturer because you have to think that design is one of the strongest reasons for purchasing a car. The potential customer of, of a car uh, has to fall in love uh, with a car at first sight. Yeah, it's something very emotional and something that definitely the design is a big part of it. Of course, it's also the brand as well. Uh, now, uh, for sale to make this, this stamp, this, this mark on the market, definitely we need something that will be recognizable as Seat. Um, typically, you have the face of the car is one of the, the most important elements that can help you to achieve such a thing. And in particular, not only the grille, that is definitely very important, I also would like to highlight the, the, the lamps, the lighting signature of the car, because it's more and more important, and it will help you to identify a Seat from 100 meters. You can see that the car approaching is a Seat. And this we do it, for example, as I said, thanks to the lighting signature. While it is, of course, important to have a good-looking car, we ask our interviewees to elaborate on roominess and handling features of these vehicles. Yeah, the roominess uh, of those three cars is very important because customers looking forward for SUVs, for this kind of body types, they are looking for a big trunk volume. So, and this is the reason why they feel they need 
this kind of ruminants in the trunk, but also they need this kind of ruminous feeling also when they enter in the car and sit in a higher position. So they have the feeling that sitting higher, they have much more space around them. So, and this is the reason why roominess is so important for them. Handling is a very important feature for our cars because Seat is a sport uh, brand. So we are really, we have sporty DNA and this is the reason why handling is very important. But it's important to have a very good handling in all possible situations. For example, Arona is a car which is thought for the city. So we have a very sporty handling, but is thought for the city, to have a very agile handling in the city. When we talk about uh, Ateca, then of course we keep this agile handling in the city, but for Ateca we look for a much better handling, a more sporty handling for the road. It's a car that is really dry, can, can really drive fast, and this is why we are looking for a very good handling for the road. And when we talk about Tarraco, it's one step forward, and then we have a very agile handling in the city, in the road, but then also in off-road conditions. When it comes to design, ruminous handling and style, Sierra has taken, like they do with every aspect of their fleet, a very familial approach, leaving their own family crest by ensuring that the style and look of their fleet helps complement the innovative approach they take with every other aspect of their SUVs.